Hello everyone. How does one become a great writer? And of course, it, by the way, if you wonder why I'm uh, swishing around in my mouth, it's because I have a peppermint in my mouth. But anyway, um, so how does uh, someone become known as a great writer? Now, notice that I didn't say, notice that I didn't say, how does someone become a great writer from an artistic perspective? Because that's a different question. I'm talking about how does someone become known as a great writer? Well, first of all, someone doesn't become known as a great writer simply because they're great. Um, that, that just doesn't happen. They have to be a great writer to a certain extent, but, but also ha they have to receive a certain level of recognition from the society at large. So a certain level of media recognition, or they have to be propped up by, let's say, a university. A lot of writers become known as great writers because they're taught in universities, and and then, and then so the teachers keep telling everybody, well, this is a great writer, you know. And then people end up grow up believing it because that's what they hear. I'm not saying it isn't necessarily true, but people, ha but writers have to have the support of outside media and institutions to have any to have any hope of of becoming uh, known as a great writer, and. I, you know, it's sad that, and I would actually, I actually think that there are um, many p people out there now and in the past who, who m may be even better writers than the people who we consider to be great writers, but we'll never know about them because uh, we were, we have never been exposed to them. And so, um, so for example, I'm sure that I can almost guarantee you that somewhere out there, is a, a man, let's say, or a woman, or a woman, who uh, someone who, let's say, tried to um, get published as a writer in the 1950s or 60s, and they were a really great writer, but no publishing company, say, would take them on, and eventually they got discouraged, and then they started to just write for themselves, and now they're old, perhaps they're in a nursing home, and they're they're having certain cognitive problems, perhaps they don't even remember that they're, that there's um. A manuscript in a drawer somewhere that um, is a masterpiece, and ultimately it will be forgotten by time. I feel that that has happened um, to many writers uh, throughout history, because because again, you can't become a, uh, known as a great writer simply because you're great. A lot of luck is involved when it comes to getting exposure, and so. Um, so if someone says that all you need to be known as a great writer is to be great, no, a lot of uh, luck is involved as well. So those are my thoughts uh, for the day.